The astronauts walked off the jet less than an hour ago. Next Wednesday, they will be taking off from Cape Canaveral. News 6's James Barbero joins us live from Brevard County now. And James, the excitement is building. It sure is, especially for Bob Bankin and Doug Hurley, Lisa, not to mention NASA Administrator Jim Bridenstine, who was there as well on the old shuttle runway, these shuttle veterans now going to fly the SpaceX Crew Dragon for the first time, flying in today on the Gulfstream jet from Houston. Here's the astronauts more on why they're so excited for this mission next week. This is a, an awesome time to be an astronaut with a, a new spacecraft to get a chance to go and fly. As graduates of uh, military test pilot schools, if you uh, give, gave us one thing that we could have put on our list of uh, dream jobs that we would have gotten to have someday, it would have been to be aboard a new spacecraft. We're looking forward to getting uh, up close and personal with uh, Falcon 9 and Crew Dragon here in just a few days. Bob and Doug will get to do that very quickly because Saturday, Matt and Lisa, that's their dress rehearsal when they're going to ride out to launch pad 39A back there. Elon Musk's Tesla is doing the drive out there. They're going to take the elevator up to the top of the launch tower. They're going to walk the crew access arm. They're going to step inside right where the Crew Dragon will be, the brand new spaceship, these inaugural SpaceX astronauts. All before, of course, the real thing, which is Wednesday, a week away from the return of American space flight from Florida nine years ago. It's been a long time and a lot of people have been waiting. The NASA administrator, he compared the troubling times we're in now to the 1960s during the Apollo program. He said during the war in Vietnam, during division in the country, NASA was able to unite the country. Today the NASA administrator Matt and Lisa called Bob and Doug bright lights for our country right now. It is very exciting, James. Looking forward to next Wednesday for sure. Ahead of the big launch, we want to keep you up to date on the latest space news in a convenient way. Everything you need to know can be sent right to your email. Just go to clickorlando.com slash newsletter, enter your email address, and check the box of the news you'd like to receive.